Welcome to the vlog. Hope your day is going well and uh, things are progressing along smoothly for you. Um, it's uh, still cloudy here. <laughs> We've got chances of rain through tomorrow, so that's good. The high tomorrow is supposed to be in the 60s. In May, Texas, for Texas, that's pretty unheard of. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. So, uh, that's uh, interesting. <laughs> it's only supposed to get up in the 70s today. It feels pretty warm out here though, I, I must admit. It does feel pretty warm out here. Um, enjoying the, the time uh, that we have. I'm taking Maggie for a walk. That's what I'm looking uh, over at every once in a while to see what she's up to. Never know what she might get into. <laughs> Anyhow, glad you're with uh, me today, and uh, and uh, hope you enjoy the vlog. It's my niece Emily's birthday too today, so happy birthday Emily. Uh, have, I hope you're having a great day and things are going smoothly and happy for you today. On one of the vlogs last week I was talking about vlogging and the reasons why I was vlogging. I left out one of the main reasons which was uh, uh, having a way for my family to keep up with me and uh, that was one of the big ones uh, so many of them I'm hearing are, are uh, watching my videos and, and uh, uh, keeping up with me this way and uh, I hear from them from time to time and they always talk about seeing my videos so, uh, I appreciate them uh, talking to me about that enjoy doing the videos so uh, I don't see any reason why to, to quit watching I mean quit making the videos <laughs> oh boy I wonder what I wonder what Maggie has found I don't see anything but there is Something quiet sitting out in the middle of the road. Which is probably what she's um, barking at if I were guessing. Gotten quite a lot of rain today. It's uh, fallen quite heavily, so the ground is starting to get uh, soft. <laughs> Which we haven't had soft ground because of rain in a long time. <laughs> So happy to see it and uh, to feel it under my feet. Oh, wonderful feeling. The wind is out of the north, and uh, that's another interesting thing. The high today is supposed to be in the 60s. The high Friday is supposed to be in uh, like 100. <laughs> Today's Tuesday, Friday 100. Possibly Thursday, getting upper 90s, 100. <laughs> we'll see how we do. <laughs> That's pretty wide range there. I have something on my mind, and I just wanted to kind of relax here and and tell you a little bit about it. Of course, it's going to depend on if this one, Miss Feisty, <laughs> is going to let me. <laughs> Try it again. Um, the Texas legislature has a couple bills in them that uh, uh, have kind of caught my attention, and one of them in particular has given me uh, pause right now because it kind of gives uh, business people permission to. Uh, 
use their religious beliefs as an excuse to discriminate against a certain group of people. And this group has been discriminated against forever. And in my view, it um, it's born out of not love, but hey, and if you want to get through to you know somebody and try to influence them, uh, you've never been able to influence anybody by hitting them up against the wall. And you've got a group uh, of people that uh, has been hit up against the wall verbally. Uh, abused for uh, most of their lives and then uh, in the name of their religion you want to discriminate and abuse them again this way and uh, that's fence building instead of bridge building in my view and does not show love which is what your faith is supposed to be showing is love. And uh, I, I just don't get how that faith uh, can show love in this way. So uh, think of about that if you're viewing this about uh, you know it about building that that fence uh, instead building a bridge building relationships through love like Jesus did instead of building fences and uh, walling people off uh, uh, in that uh, community based on religion. Um, I just I, I wanted to say that because that bill uh, has been talked about this week and to me it's discrimination against you know a population of LGBTQ people and uh, it's a group that uh, Christians have clashed with but not in a good way uh, they have not I mean some some Christians have shown love and built relationships like the owner of Chick-fil-A did but so many have not and uh, I, I really want you to uh, think about that uh, you don't have to understand whether coming from on their lifestyle to understand and love them as a person. Well, it's been a nice couple of days and it was a great weekend to go to Ranch Rodeo and uh, um, I hope uh, that you understand where my thoughts came from. And, of love in my heart. Be sure to be kind to one another and love each other. And always remember that I love you. Remember to subscribe if you're not already. And to like and share with others if they, you think they enjoy this vlog. And we'll see you next time.